hello everyone in this video you will understand what is mean by a clock skew okay so for that i have taken a sequential circuit based on a pipeline concept okay as we all know that a sequential circuit is made up of combinational logic and flip flops okay and in the synchronous uh, sorry in sequential circuit all the flip flops are supplied by a common clock okay as indicated here hmm. we will understand what is meant by clock skew now so i have two flip flops flip flop 1 receiving clock 1 from the main clock and also the clock 2 receives the clock signal from the main clock itself okay now we will understand this uh, actually let us consider uh, this is the clock signal the global clock okay <coughs> clock let us uh, take this is the reference line okay for a global clock suppose uh, i am receiving clock 1 t clock 1 similar to my reference clock or the global clock okay this is t clock 1 okay suppose i am receiving a clock 2 signal after some time delay okay this one this delta is represented by clock skew okay sorry this is clock 2 therefore a clock skew is nothing but the <coughs> variations in the arrival time of the clock transition which means that here it is considered as a positive edge as we know that a flip flop is a positive edge trigger device here we will consider the flip flop is a positive edge trigger device okay so the arrival time of clock to each flip flop is different we will define it as a clock skew okay so this is the clock edge the clock one edge is arrived as similar to the global clock so this is a global clock okay this is global clock okay and at the flip-flop 2 I am receiving the same clock edge after some time with, res with reference to the the main clock signal okay again I am receiving the same positive trigger so this is represented as a clock skew okay so therefore we, the definition for a clock skew is the arrival time of the clock transition is known as a clock skew okay the variation in the arrival time of a clock signal is known as clock skew okay <coughs> based upon uh, the direction of signal we have uh, two types of clock skew so if both the input flow input data flow and the clock flow is in the same direction this is known as positive skew okay when both input flow and then data uh, sorry both uh, data flow and then clock flow is in the same direction will define it is the positive skew okay suppose in this circuit the data flow and the clock flow are in opposite direction so therefore this is a negative skew okay we will get negative skew here okay and this is positive skew okay fine so in the upcoming lectures we will understand how this skew affects the performance and the functionality of a sequential circuit okay thank you